Good morning, everyone. It's Tuesday, December 31st, 2019. Today's video is going to show you some of the catches we had on December 29th, last Sunday, and a few catches we had today, plus follow up with a couple sets we just put in. But before we get to that, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button, that notification bell. Everyone else returning, thank you so much for your support. It's greatly appreciated. And before we get started, Landon, I ran into your mom the other day. She says you don't miss an episode, so I want to say thank you very, very much. That means a lot to me. Let's get the video. We are at one of the DPs on that new property we set up the other day. This is actually a set we caught the coon in that we didn't show on video the other day. Another possum. A little possum, but we're going to get him out and get it reset. We were down here on the creek on that new property where Cody put in a couple bait hole sets the other day. See his drag right there. Lo and behold, second possum of the day. Looks like they were running good last night. We're going to get him out and uh, get it reset. We are at the creek. We are at the trail. We put a dog proof on this side. Of course, nothing's in it. And over there is where they were crossing. Had all the claw marks where they were going up the bank. Tied one off that tree. You can see looking at us through the fence. Nice big raccoon caught on that uh, Jeff Dunlap's smoke fish DP bait. I'm telling you, that stuff has tore the coons up for us in these dog proof this year. We're gonna get him taken care of. Get the trap reset. And move on. We are over the set. In the field that connected on that ugly coyote I caught connected on another coon muddy coon but it's another good sized coon so far this set here is taking that ugly coyote a big coon and another big coon so do square draw number two standard dirt hole back foot catch just like the last coon was so we're gonna get him taken care of get this remade all right, we're on this four-wheeler trail. At the very top up there is where Cody has his two coyote sets on the lane in the woods. We come down here last year and did some scouting around and caught a couple coon down here. So we put in a couple sets down here the other day. Got a body grip and a dog proof. So got a little creek down here that we uh, set on. Let me tell you, it's been a muddy mess the last two days. Today's what, December 31st, 2019, Tuesday, New Year's Eve day. Conibear set right there. Got a little stream coming there, and a stream coming from up there, and they meet right here, and the coons have been coming up over here and going on down, following the creek the rest of the way down. Put a dog proof right over here. See, hooked onto a nice, nice big raccoon. First catch of the day, we've checked quite a few properties. Only thing we caught on the 30th was a possum and a body grip. We didn't film it, it was just too nasty out to try, even try to film. So, that is a big, pretty raccoon. Just set the dog proof here in case they come across the land right through here. And uh, sure enough, he did and got nabbed. So we're going to get him taken care of, get the trap reset. And as you noticed in the video of the catches from Sunday the 29th, we've been catching some big raccoons, so can't complain. At least they've all been big. All right, we're going to get off here and get him taken care of. We are on the trail 
That's a prop that we just set up a few days ago. Cody put in a couple bait hole sets in the creek. You can see we got this really, really black coon. The other one's right down there, nothing messed with it. This is our second coon of the day. Another big one. But man, that is a dark one. Like I said, we've been tearing the big coons up, so we've got some more traps to check. So hopefully we'll have some more. This is our second New Year's Eve coon. I'm going to get him taken care of and get the set we made. We are down at this creek. I just got done putting in a new coyote set. I was going to try to film that and show you the area, but the wind was just too bad. So no more catch today. We ended up those two huge raccoons for a New Year's Eve catch. So we come down here and uh, put in a couple bait hole sets. Oh, we got this creek running here and intersecting this bigger creek. So got a Duke one and a half garden the bait hole right there. Already got it baited up. Then right over here, show you this other set. I see the trap down there got the bait hole right there got to wire it off this big cherry log these bait holes are quick and easy to make like I said they'll catch mink muskrat or raccoon so that's gonna end it for today thank you all for coming along our trap line uh, we'll see you in the next video